Greetings, viewers. Brad, proprietor of Barstool Entertainment, interrupting my regular schedule and posting a special video. A couple days ago, I posted a video about stealing a Patriot vehicle from the Easter Basin military installation. And that turned out to be, well, adject failure. Um, you're going to wind up getting crushed or it's going to get, you're going to get killed. However way you try and steal that vehicle, you automatically get a five-star wanted level. And I did that just for fun. Now, there is an easier way to get a Patriot that you can do the import-export mission, and I will be covering how to actually purchase a vehicle once I get this Patriot um, exported. And the easiest Patriot to get is at the Easter Basin Chemical uh, refinery, factory, whatever you want to call it. You see it as I'm trying to loop-de-loop -loop and gain some altitude with this small airplane. And the right there you can see the factory. I'm going to get this thing leveled out so that CJ can parachute to the Patriot. And once I get this leveled out here, yep, CJ is gone. And boom. Now, if you can see it, not quite yet, you see the Easter Basin factory, chemical factory, or Easter Bay chemical factory, and you can bring CJ to this place, and there is a Patriot, which you can steal. And it is, you can start seeing it once it comes into focus and you get closer. Um, Right there to the far left of the screen. Yep, you can see that Patriot. This is very easy to steal. And I'm gonna, gonna walk CJ up and steal the Patriot. No muss, no fuss, just a auto alarm and no five star wanted level. So all you have to do is drive this Patriot to the Easter Basin docks and export it. Now, one of the things I'm going to have to clarify um, in the Easter Basin docks when you import or, or actually when you export vehicles. Yes, if you damage them, you lose value, but here's the thing. I had stated that there was a flat rate in which you are paid. That is incorrect. Each vehicle has a certain value to it, and you get less money for less valuable vehicles. It just makes sense. And when you get a more valuable vehicle, you get more money. In this case, the Patriot is actually a more valuable vehicle. You get about $40,000, and I've already done some damage to it, but the reality is, unless you really smash up a vehicle, um, you're going to get some value for it. And going to the paint and spray, yeah, I mean, you're not going to spend a couple hundred bucks for, let's say, a Sanchez to get it redone when you got something like, it's only going to be a couple thousand bucks you're going to get. Now, you bring the vehicle up here, park it, and then enter the crane and put the vehicle onto the boat. As I stated before, you want to use that shadow circle to kind of position it over your vehicle. And 
once you get it positioned over the vehicle, you can start lowering the magnet. And you got to maneuver things a little bit. But once you have the car picked up, you can raise it up and bring it to the deck of the ship. And once you bring it to the deck of the ship, you have successfully exported the vehicle. And any vehicle you export, you can purchase. In fact, there's other vehicles you can purchase as well. And once I'm done exporting this vehicle, I will explain how to purchase and lower it down and release the vehicle. And you have successfully delivered this vehicle for export. Now, let's get on with the actual got $38,720. Now, let's go on with purchasing a vehicle. When you run up to this board, it shows you what's wanted. And when you get close, you can press Y and you can buy vehicles. Now, it sh shows you Tuesday. So this is vehicles you can buy on Tuesday. If you try and buy a vehicle on Monday or whatever, it's not the proper day. I'm going to buy a Patriot because I can, 32000 It appears on the deck of the ship. Now, if you tried to buy a vehicle on Monday and it's a Tuesday, you won't be able to purchase that vehicle. Kind of sucks. Now, you got to run up the gangplank to get to the vehicle. And you can drive it off. Well, with this larger vehicle, it's a little difficult to drive off. You can actually just get into the crane, lower it down, pick up the vehicle, and set the vehicle down. I'm just going to drive it off on this. But the reality is, for vehicles like this Patriot, you're better off just using the crane to pick it up. Now... This vehicle is actually kind of a nice vehicle, very durable. There are going to be other vehicles that are much larger that you can export and then purchase that driving off would be unrealistic. Again, you can use the crane. I just drove it off. And this is the easiest way to get a Patriot. Once you've exported, you can purchase it. And... Now I'm going to go have some fun and drive around here and maybe uh, pick up an escort or should I say prostitute. Oops. Show, get in. Are you screwing with me? I'm gonna make you feel like a real. Okay, I don't know if this is gonna be allowed in this video. I might end up having to edit this, but yeah, I'm going to bring her to the um, favorite makeout area and fast forward, and then explain something. How shall I say? Interesting that I've noticed. One of the things I noticed is when uh, you kind of get busy with the lady, if you look at the money, it starts going down in the upper right corner, and <laughs> that's kind of humorous. As things get a little going, um, yeah, she takes your money, and it goes down. But hey, I'm Brad, proprietor of Barstool Entertainment. Um, Bring you some entertainment. Thanks for stopping by. Say what you want, but I know I was the best you ever had.